Speaking of coming to Provo, yes. a few minutes ago, four-star guard Delaney Gibb announced her commitment to Amber Whiting's basketball program at BYU, choosing the Cougars over just about everybody. A 5'10 superstar from Raymond, Alberta, heralded as among the best young Canadian players in the country. ESPN ranks her number 48 among the top 100. She's number two in all of Canada for her age group. I've seen her play. She's got a gift for the game. She'll play her senior year in Canada and join the Cougars for year two in the Big 12. And Delaney joins us live from Alberta at her big announcement party. And there she is. Hey, congratulations. Thank you. Way to go. Way to make a great choice, Delaney. Congratulations. <laughs> we're, we're a little biased, but we think you made a great choice. T tell us why you chose BYU. Um... Uh Honestly, I went on visits basically everywhere and BYU just felt like home to me. Um, I have cousins and grandparents that went to BYU um, and really I just felt comfortable there and felt like it's somewhere where I can be great. You are familiar with Provo. You played your freshman year at Timfew just down the road from us, even though we call our show at an undisclosed location yeah but uh, he keeps giving it away delaney like people are going to start coming here because he's giving away our site but look as a freshman your first team all state is that when you thought to yourself hey you know what i'm going places with basketball honestly yeah for sure um when i was younger i just played to have fun like i just really enjoyed playing basketball but i think that um that year, my freshman year, and then leading into like spring ball and AAU was when I really like decided like, this is what I want to do. Like, I want to be really good. And things kind of just took off from there. You know, in, in one season uh, at the helm, Amber Whiting pulled together the highest recruiting class in program history. This last year's recruit, recruiting class, remarkable. You're the headliner now for the second class, for her second yeah. class coming in for this 24-25 season. What did you see in Amber Whiting and her staff that can help her uh, and help you further develop your game? Um, I really love Amber. Um, I think she's a great coach and she's super hardworking and she pushes every athlete to do the same. Um, and yeah, I think she's doing something special. Um, she's uh, changing the program, getting great recruits to come. And so, yeah, I'm just super excited. Tell us about your game. What is it about Delaney Gibb that has her among the most sought after Canadian basketball players in the entire country? Um, honestly, I'm a point guard, but I can score the ball really well. So I think that's what kind of puts me apart from other athletes. Um, yeah. So, so Delaney, are we, when you say you can score, are you a triple threat? Can you put it on the floor and, and take it to the rack? Can Do you have a mid-range game? Can you step back and knock down threes or or just at all of it? Can you do all of that? Yeah, I I would say I can pretty much do it all. I think I definitely have the best, like I would say I'm the better, how do I want to say this? Like I shoot the three the most. So I shoot the three from deep, um, which allows me to then attack, you know, because defenders have to come up on me and then gives me space to attack and create from there. Well, I watched you play when you came down and beat my niece over there at American Fork, and uh, you uh, you have a fun game. Uh, Delaney Gibbs on the Wise Guys. We're live on YouTube, Facebook, Twitch, and YSGuys.com around the world tonight, earlier in the hour. She announced her commitment to come play basketball at, at BYU. What do you think of competing in the Big 12? I'm super excited. Um, I think to be in a Power 5 conference um, and to be – one of the first years, not the first, but one of the first years coming in as a freshman to be able to play in this conference. Um, I'm excited to really make a mark and prove ourselves. Hey, how happy are your folks, Alan and Tanya, um, about you coming to BYU? Were they happy with that decision? And how much of a role did they play in helping you make that decision? Yeah, they're they're both super happy. Um, I They definitely had an impact, but I think the choice was mine so they were just there more for support well your dad's been your coach right yeah. for for all of your high school career is he a good coach is he nice to does he say shoot whenever you want or what, how does he how does he mold your game um he's a bit of a yeller so <laughs> he might um get into it a little bit but yeah he's been 
he's been really great. He's been super supportive of me. And um, yeah, I mean, I shoot the ball a lot and he's okay with it. So. <laughs> That's a nice so, dad. So when, when do you have the green light? Is he like, um, and I don't know, are you old enough to remember when Jimmer Fredette was playing on the men's team here at BYU? Are you familiar with Jimmer at all? Yeah. Uh-huh. You know, Jimmer used to tell us he had the green light when he got off the bus. He's allowed to shoot <laughs> from the minute he got off the bus. Um, wh where was your dad comfortable with giving the green light? Like just as soon as you cross half court, yep, whatever you want to do, Delaney, is that the way it goes? Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Man, that's awesome. I love it. That's awesome. I love it. A lot of us are told not to shoot ever. But yeah. to look I, I tell Dave to stick to free throws and layups, but, <laughs> but that's... Hey, what is your basketball plan for the next 12 months before you get here? So I'm hoping to be on the U19 Canadian national team, uh, where we'll be in Spain this July for the FIBA World Cup. Um, and then after that, I plan on playing high school in Raymond again, uh, trying to go for provincial champ number three. Nice. Um, and then after that, just getting ready to be a Coug. So what about representing your country at the Olympics? Is that something you want to do in 2028? Is that a goal that you have down the road? And yeah, tell, tell us about that. Yeah. Sorry, yeah. what was that you cut out of there? Oh yeah, I, 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 we brought, so how, how, why is that so important to you to, to be on that 2028 Olympic team? Um, for me, I just think that representing my country is one of the coolest experiences ever. Um, and not only my country, but I get to represent Raymond as a town and Alberta as a province. And so um, it just brings me like a lot of pride to be able to do that. Well, Delaney, I've been uh, your Aunt Sharon's home teacher since 2012. So the whole neighborhood really? is uh, is celebrating your decision to come to Provo. Nice job. Thank you. We're proud of you. We look forward to getting to know you and following your career here. And now, of course, we feel like we are we're tied to the Raymond Alberta High School basketball program yeah, for the next season. And when you're when you're down here, um, we'll, we'll get you when you're down here officially a Cougar. We'll get you on the show. Only you can come in studio with us and do it right. Okay. Delaney Gibb, congratulations on your commitment to BYU. We'll see you soon. Have a wonderful time over the summer in Spain. Represent now you represent BYU wherever you go. Remember that. Now yeah. you now it's a little bit more than than the, than your high school. But uh, hey, it's a pleasure to have you with us. And and go enjoy the rest of the night. We'll see you soon. Yep. And keep Thank keep grinding so and keep working. Yes, I will. Thank you. Thank you. That's Delaney, Delaney Gibb, and had a visit with her dad today, and they're just so stoked. Uh, the parents didn't go to BYU, but so many of the Gibb family have. Right. Grandparents, uncles, aunts, uh, cousins, and um, and it was a tough get. You know, she was she was a highly sought after player, and and and, and you go on uh, you go, you go onto YouTube, and you see Oklahoma State, Oklahoma, Gonzaga, Utah went heavy, heavy after her. BYU was in the mix all along, and and in the end, BYU wins. Delaney Gibb. The Indies.